Hello everyone and welcome back to Satisfactory. So yeah, we were able to get this uh, hub set up and everything. And uh, now we're on to our first uh, post-tutorial objective, as you can see in the top right corner. Build the space elevator. So I kind of like how we have this laid out. Although my only slight qualm... Oh. Hello. That was scary. Thought he was going to throw a rock or something at me. Is that, uh... These are just so high up. But that's beside the point. Let's go ahead and interact with the terminal. Alright. So we've uh, finished through tier 0. So now tier 1. All sorts of fun stuff, huh? Okay. I do like the idea of foundations, which is good. Just go ahead and select that as a milestone. Let's see what we need to build the space elevator. Oh, that's not bad. We just need a ton of stuff. But it's all simple, really. So, I mean, nothing too crazy, though. Yeah, so you complete the space elevator and we'll have a whole bunch of tiers and stuff. And we could put it on our to-do list on the right side. Pretty handy and dandy if I do say so myself. So yeah, we're just going to need uh, a lot of everything, really. Alright, so we're just going to be putting some stuff we don't exactly need into here. And we should be good. I love sort buttons. They're pretty awesome. Alright, so we're just going to be running around, checking stuff. I don't know if we exactly need to set up a whole bunch of automation to get this stuff going. But, um, we'll see. Because we just, I mean, it's just a lot of simple stuff. Like, nothing ridiculous or crazy or anything like that. So, I'm not 100% sure how worth it it'll be to do that. Sure, it'll help us, I guess, in the long run. Hmm. We'll see. We'll see. Alright, so here's a question. What exactly does base building give us? We get foundations, basic walls and ramps and stuff. Which is nice. It is nice. Maybe we do need to speed this up. Okay, what do we need? First, we will need to put a miner down, then smelters, then constructors. Do we have any storage? We do. Excellent. Okay. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to uh, make iron plates with these. I'm going to put down miners on each one of those. And then do smelters for the iron and the copper. Just to get those out of the way. And then I'll do constructors for wire, iron, plate probably. And concrete. Yeah, but I think getting the uh, smelters going is really going to help out just overall for now. Okay, so that's probably what I'm going to do, but uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. All right, so we should go ahead and start with iron. So for that, we need to check, and right, we're going to need to do power and all that stuff too. We've already got the biomass burners on the back. So all of this stuff, we're going to need some wire, but that's not going to be too terrible. Conveyor belt's pretty cheap overall. All right. So first off, the miner, which is good. Okay. Just need to pick this one up. Putting this down. Oh, there looks good. Great. Excellent. All right. So two seconds to, okay. So one iron ore. So you get 30 per minute. Not bad. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and make some uh, biomass because we're going to need to uh, get that done. Putting those in there for now. Now we need a smelter. And this should be good to go here. Right? We don't need to put like... One iron ore. 30 per minute into one per minute. Or not, but yeah. So this should be fine.
There we go. So it's going to be doing that. It's going to be processing it into here, which will be fine. We just need to route some power to it, which we can do here. Need to make some wire because I currently don't have any. Uh, we probably won't need a ton. I'm going to do like 20 power line to that. Here to here. Here. Can I connect to there? To there. All right. Looks terrible, but it'll be okay for now. And should put another one around probably here for like a constructor. And I should move another one. Gonna pick that up. So then what we're gonna do is put, excuse me, miner on top of here. Nope, we don't need a smelter for that. Just a constructor. Need reinforced iron plates for that. Well, we need reinforced iron plates. We need some screws. Wow, a lot of screws. All right, there we go. And we'll make six. These take a lot. Holy crap. All right, go ahead and do... Hmm, do we want to do a constructor? No, we don't need one there for now. We will eventually, but not at the moment. There we go. Put one of these right here. There to there, there to there, there to there, and there to there. All right. And then I'll move this one to way back here. Not sure how far these can go, but we will figure it out, won't we? Looks like it's getting dark or something. There we go. Excuse me. As we get all this, then we're going to construct a miner. Can we not? Oh, iron plates. Crap. All right, I'll be right back once I grab those. Actually, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and power this thing. Need biofuel, though. All right. There we go. Those are going. I'm not needing now, but we will soon. Concrete. Forgot to configure it. It's roughly one per 15 minute. That's how it goes. Well, we've got automation going. What's up, buddy? Ooh. Productive Packer Deluxe. Interesting. That sounds like a way to waste my time. Oh my god. It's a llama. Or an alpaca. Kind of hard to tell the difference. Alright. Just going to be doing this for a little bit. So we can get some more iron plates. And we should be good. All right, now we can do some more copper while we're here. So nothing too crazy. We've got the uh, concrete being made over there. And to the right of us, we have iron ingots being smelted, which is great. So yeah, all's, uh, all's going well. All right, so we've got the plates. How's this going so far? Pretty good, it's up to 45. I'm not sure how much uh, storage these things have on them. Uh, looks like a hundred. Well, crap. It's gonna be running and grabbing these things. It'll be fine. No worries. All right. Go ahead and get this miner on here. There we go. This one wants smelter. Then we want a constructor. We're missing some cables. That's all right. Oh man, missing some wires too, huh? All right, I have wires now. So we should be good. Make sure this actually connects to it. There we go. So both of those are connected, right? And this will be copper. Oh no. Pulling too much power, I guess. Or maybe I ran out of uh, juice. We'll have to see. Oh, yeah, too much, uh, too much stuff in there, huh? There we go. 
New fear unlocked. Yeah, blew the fuse by using too much power. Great. Didn't know I needed that one, but um, sure enough, it's very scary. Well, let's make sure we're good on this. Oh yeah, this is good. Gonna put a constructor. There we go. And then this will make wire. Excellent. All right, cool. That'll be working and we're gonna be good. All right, well, those are working. So we're doing good. We don't have splitters, do we? Or combiners, I mean. No, we don't. We might want that. I think for now it'll be okay. Well, so far, so good. As you can see, I'm almost done with the iron plates. About halfway done with that concrete. It's uh, moving slower than expected. Moving over here, and I'm going to be checking how much wire we got. And honestly, not bad. It's pretty good. Could be better, because we need literally a ton of it. But that's okay. All right, we have all of the iron plates. Just working on these rods. And the concrete and everything else should be uh, continuing on its merry way. All right, so we're almost a third of the way there with the wire. Pretty good, pretty good. This uh, concrete is just real slow. Not 100% sure why, but I'm sure it's just the numbers not matching up or something like that, but we'll figure it out. It's not that big a deal right now. Right now, it's just about getting the thing done. Then we work on optimizing it later. Oh, don't mind me just running around picking grass and stuff. No, uh, no big deal here. Just, you know, don't mind me. Just uh, burning some time, gathering resources while uh, our production is happening. These little birdie friends being all cute and stuff. And then while we're at it, we're going to be checking on this. Nice, another 30. Which is good. Continue to pick up all these leaves and stuff. Who leave these bushes all here and everything? It's crazy. We used to plant a crafter where you had to make all this stuff. Well, most of it. Wow, the efficiency of wood to uh, biomass is just insane. Holy crap. Pretty good, I tell you what. All right, so I'm going to look around. Jumping around here, doing some exploring. See if I see anything. Oh, there you go. Just like more of those. Ooh, I see another couple of berry bushes. There's this one, and there's this one over here as well. There we go. Ooh, bauxite. That's neat. That's a new resource we haven't found yet. I wonder what that's used for at the moment. I don't know. Oh, what's this? Oh, yeah, more berries. Let's go. Now, in case I'm mistaken, those do grow back. Oh, boy. What's this? What is that thing? Whoa. Oh, it's poison. Oh, God. Ow, and something's shooting me. Okay, that's dangerous place. Leave me alone. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to stumble upon your ritual or something. Am I getting chased? Please don't be chasing me. I didn't mean to bother you. I'm just trying to, you know, hang out. Figure out what's going on. Oh, good. They left. I was worried about that. Picking all the berries. I don't know what I need them for, but I definitely need them for something. All right, so what do we got here? Sulfur. Okay. Ooh, Ada. Unknown chemical element collected. This non-metallic and multivalent element seems to be present only in a solid state and exhibits a most pungent smell. It is fortunate fix-it helmets are of such high quality. Store this potential resource for later use. Okay, it's stinky, got it. Very stinky indeed. Now this looks like something I could blow up. Don't worry, I know there's explosives in the game. I am nowhere close to uh, worrying about that just yet. But it's good to know that it's around. 
gonna be good once I unlock the map so I can kind of look around and choose some directions to explore because right now oh all that poison looks terrible so is that up there I think it's coming from those like stacks or whatever Ooh, what's this oh it's just iron I mean I'll take it you know if you're just gonna offer it to me for free sure and then what's this it looks like another iron deposit Thank you, thank you. I appreciate your uh, nice donation to the uh, help me get space elevator fund. Why is this, like, barren? It's kind of scary. I'm not sure why. But I don't... Ooh, coal! Let's go! First time finding that this playthrough. Let's go. Nice. Okay, let's see. What do we have over here? Looks like potential more coal, maybe? Yep, coal. Alright, thanks for the coal, everybody. Oh, hello. What do we have here? Looks like a crash site. With a couple of friends. Ow. Ow. Come on, buddy. There we go. I got him, and I didn't die. I just have a whole bunch of stuff around here. I didn't drop all this, but I sure will take it. Just give me so much stuff. I appreciate it. Let's open it. Broken battery. Okay. Let's just go ahead and do a biomass burner. There. And let's just put some, uh... That in there, and there we go. Go ahead and open it. 40? Oh, 40's a lot! Holy crap! Alright, and then we'll do this to here. And then we'll do this to here. Yeah, I know, I know. Just gonna put that in there, and then we'll do this. And it should be good. Open this. Alright, what we got? Hard drive. Containing fix it data, analyze it, and the MAM to salvage its contents. Alright, sweet. Damaged hard drive successfully acquired. All pioneers are contractually obliged to preserve and secure any recovered hard drives for future analysis, which may result in benefits to the Fixit mission. Speculation as to why there are crashed freighters in your Fixit designated zone is discouraged as specified in your contract. All right. So don't question it. They're just uh, crashed. Got it. Don't worry, I, uh, I'm not known to question things. Totally. Yep, that's, uh, that's not me. All right, so let's head back to the hub. Got some more goodies, so that's nice. Oh, that was almost terrible. I don't know exactly how crazy fall damage in the, is in this game. I'm sure one of y'all will hopefully be kind and let me know. Or I can just experiment, you know, nothing, nothing crazy like, wee. Oh. I'm fine. We'll see how much damage this heals over time. And, uh, yeah. Just gonna be traveling back. No problems. Oh, no. Okay, not terrible. So there is fall damage. Did not realize, uh... That was there. My bad. It was a ye old whoopsie daisy. Kinda going a roundabout way of getting there. There we go. Let me up here. Thank you very much. All right. Grabbing some of these. Not falling, hopefully. I like the nice floating grass right there. That's cool. What is this? Oh, I thought it was something. It's just a rock. Well, you know what? Rocks are things too. Oh, sorry. I didn't even see you standing there, bro. My bad. Didn't mean to disturb you. Just, uh, you know. Making my way over here, hanging out, you know, doing my thing. 
Wow, that's a lot. That's that's pretty good, not gonna lie. Need to run off in that direction more often. I wonder how this concrete's doing. Ooh, I'm almost done with the concrete. I must have found a whole bunch. Well, this is excellent. This has obviously just stopped working because it's super full. Oh, speaking of full, my inventory. All right, I'm going to check that in there. And we're going to go ahead and make some more iron rods. So we should be good with that one. Then all we need to do is just work on the iron. Sorry, not the iron. We should focus on the wire. And really with that, we just kind of have to wait. Not even that much longer either. I really collected so many leaves. That's crazy. And there was just so much more I just didn't get to. All right, I'm going to go ahead and toss some stuff into here. Like all of the coal. I'm sorting. Bauxite, sulfur can go. As well as these. That should be good now. Awesome. I'm going to go check out the wire. Probably not a lot, but, you know, every little bit counts. That was more than I thought. Pretty good, pretty good. Just gonna use this and make some more plates, cause why not, right? I'm gonna need more for the milestones and all that stuff anyway, so I'm not really uh too worried about spending some time here constructing some more of those. So I know with the space elevator it's gonna unlock um extra things, mostly for later tiers, so Maybe not necessary that I go ahead and get it done this early, but it's just a nice big project to go ahead and get it out of the way. So yeah. I am a fan of getting a big project knocked out. Anything else cool in here? No, just... Oh, we got 104 miner, uh, portable miners. That's crazy. Can you imagine just having those like thrown everywhere? It would be cool, but so wasteful. All right, so not bad. We just need uh, a little bit more and we're good. I think I can just go over here and just mine some extra while I'm here, right? Shouldn't be too bad. I could have went and found another um, copper spot, but, you know, win some, you lose some. Oh, this is just a normal one. Okay. Well, that's good. I'm used to seeing the... Uh, the poor ones. Alright, so I might have enough now, or at least pretty close, because I've got like a hundred copper ore on me. So once I get that put through here, and then make it into wire, I can run back, grab that last little bit, and then we can make our space elevator. Which is very exciting. And that thing is huge, so we're not going to be putting it up here. We're going to be Putting it a little further away from us, but that shouldn't be a problem. All right, so I just need to run over here, grab the wire, and we should be good to go. All right, we have enough to make it. So where should we put it? Probably a little bit further down hill. Don't want to be sticking it up here because we might be using this area a little bit to make some uh, factory space or something. All right here, that should... Should be good, maybe? Oh, hey, what do we have here? Oh, there we got some enemies. Don't want to mess with those just yet. But I'll throw a space elevator here. That'd be fun. All right. Space elevator. Why is it floating? Don't float. Dun, 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 dun. Holy crap. Look at all the materials flying at it. Oh, and there it is. Nice. I love the sequence. It's just really got to hold on. Perfect. 
Alright, that's pretty sick. Project assembly initialized. Congratulations, Pioneer. The space elevator will now automatically connect with the project assembly orbital platform. Project assembly is divided into phases, each of which require the delivery of project parts, such as smart plating, via the space elevator. Subsequent phases unlock access to new tiers with more advanced technologies to construct, automate, explore and exploit. It is time to be honest. This project is part of the Save the Day program, the largest united undertaking in human history, destined to save us all. Oh. Earth is in peril and only Fix-It pioneers offer hope for survival. Fix-It is counting on you. Humanity is counting on you. Do oh, not geez. let Fix-It down. Alright. Sounds good. And with that, we have the space elevator. I think it's just so awesome. We did it, we did it, we did it, we did it, da, 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 we did it. All right, sweet. Well, that was excellent. Yeah, so we have a new uh, objective in the top right corner. We need 50 smart plates. So um, that's going to be a lot more complicated, and we're going to need to set up a factory specifically just for that. So yeah, thanks for uh, watching. And uh, if you like what I'm seeing, uh, like what you're seeing, be sure to uh, like, subscribe, drop some comments down below. And if you have any suggestions for how we should build our factory for the spark plating, uh, drop it down in the comments. I'd love to see y'all's suggestions as we uh, go through and learn this game and construct some really cool stuff. So yeah, bye everybody.